What can you do when you visit Real For Me? You can create a personal health assessment. You can use the longevity calculator. You can use all the tools that are there to help you get on the path to well-being. And it's all free. Free copies of Well-Being for Dummies, free tools to get you on the path to well-being. Start your new year right by going to realforme.com forward slash health. Well, my sink is shining, but I'm not whining, I'm flying. I'm just baby stepping in. Hey, everybody. I'm Marla Silly, the Fly Lady, and thanks for joining us on Fly Lady TV. I'm so glad you're becoming part of our Fly Lady family. We are two weeks into our new habit of keeping our sink clean and shiny. Along with this habit, we are learning a few flying tricks to keep us motivated. We're getting rid of our clutter a little each day, and we're giving ourselves stars on our calendar, and we're lacing up our shoes. I am so proud of you for jumping in where we are. Are you ready to learn how to stay on track? Let me ask you something. Have you ever found yourself in the kitchen with your hairbrush? Or in the bathroom with your spatula? How about a toothbrush in one hand and a toilet bowl brush in the other while you're on the phone? That one could be dangerous. We all seem to think that we're good at multitasking. The truth is none of us are. When we try to do two things at once, they are both half done and we end up pulling our hair out because we never get anything finished. We always feel like we're behind just trying to catch up. This gets our adrenaline pumping. Just because we're moving faster does not mean we're getting things done. I realized that when I was in a tizzy, nothing got done. I was rushing around like a chicken with its head cut off. My hound dog Lucy taught me that if I want to catch a rabbit, I have to keep my eyes on the prize and my nose down. It's so hard to stay focused when you have a sidetrack nature. That is when I found my best friend, my timer. My timer keeps me focused. I can do anything for 15 minutes. Now this is not a beat the clock race. It is a slow and steady focus on one thing. Most of us already have timers everywhere. There's one on your stove and your microwave. Most phones have timers too. I use my coffee maker as a timer to keep me focused on my dust mopping each day. A song is usually three to four minutes. That way I'm dancing as I empty the dishwasher. Some of you don't think that using your timer will help you stay focused. All I can say is once you use a timer, you will never go back to your sidetracked ways. It doesn't matter whether you set your timer for two minutes or 15 minutes. Your timer will keep you focused. Here are a few tips for using your timer. This is not a frenzied race. Slow and steady will accomplish much more. When the timer goes off, do something else. Do not crash and burn doing the same thing. Now here's another one. Every hour, set your timer for a few minutes to rest. When it goes off, you can get up and start again. Your timer is going to help you release stress and get your home organized. My timer is keeping me focused and focus makes me fabulous. You can do this. Set your timer and join me next time when I'm gonna tell you a big secret. I know what makes your home messy. You're not gonna wanna miss that. I'm Marla Silly, the Fly Lady, and thanks for joining us on Fly Lady TV. Thanks for watching, and don't forget, this is a great time to check out realforme.com forward slash health. And be sure and sign up for the Wellbeing for Dummies book. It's free. Well, my sink is shining, but I'm not whining, I'm flying. I'm just a baby stepping in. I'm not obsessing, I'm flying. I've got my list of things.